Hi guys, I'm the Cube Solver. I will be teaching you in how to solve this last two centers in a 6x6 six six cube. This is one of the most challenging parts in solving bigger cubes like this. You won't be in here if you haven't solved the other centers, so you must already know how to make a center. But the struggle here is that the moves are very limited since that your cube is down to last two centers. Now let's start just like in 4x4. Four Check if the centers are on the proper arrangement. White at the top, yellow at the bottom, and then blue, orange, and this side should be green, and this side should be red. Just a reminder, there are no exact ways on how to solve this, but I will give the techniques or the underlying concepts behind these center pieces. Let's start with the green side first. I'll face the green side at the front and the red side at the top our goal is to complete this strip on the side then this one at the middle then another one in the middle and the last strip on the side but it's up to you it may be like this side middle middle and then side again for the first strip so it is on the side we have to complete a strip so this one, it is a potential strip that can be easily completed because you only need one more. And this could complete that strip. Get it in the way and bring it down. Now we already have one strip on the side. For the second strip, okay, this one, this is a potential second strip. We just need one more in here. And this one could be in here. Bring it up, get it out of the way and bring that side back okay now we can insert this one in here bring it down get get it out of the way and bring this right side back now as you can see we already have a strip in here but as i've said it is recommended that the strip that should be solved first is the one in the middle before the one at the side because it'll be more difficult to solve the one at the middle if it is the last strip to be solved. Okay, this two could be paired up with this one in here. Get it out of the way and bring it back. Now, what centerpiece would complete this one? So I think this one could be in here. So how would we do that? Okay, so here is what I will do. Okay, get this strip out of the way. And then realign this centerpiece in here and then bring it down now we can insert this one in this strip bring it up get it out of the way and bring this right side back now we can insert this strip in here bring it down get it out of the way and bring this side back for the last strip you have to count the number of center pieces so you'll know which strips can be exchanged okay so let's see we have three red center piece in here and then one green this one has two and two green we can exchange that with this one it would be better for the red side bring it up get it out of the way and bring this side back now we're left with two on each side We'll discuss it individually first about the center corners and then we'll discuss also about the center edges if you have one last center corner pieces on both sides like this one this is what you can do about it just place the center pieces where they are nearest to each other the center pieces can be both on the right side or in this case it's on the left side but i'll do it on the right side instead okay so this is the process bring this right side up Turn the top side clockwise and bring this right side back. Now we already completed a green strip at the top and another red strip at the front. Then these strips can be exchanged now. Bring it up, get it out of the way, and bring this right side back. If you have one last center edge piece on both sides, place both of this on the right. Okay, so here is the process. Bring this right side down. Turn the front side counterclockwise. If the red strip in here lacks one red center piece, then bring the strip down. Okay. 
and you should see a letter T. Then turn the front side clockwise. If you see a complete strip at the right, bring that up and you should see that another strip is completed. Then turn the front side counterclockwise and just bring the strip back and that's it. What if for any reason, after solving all the centers, you found out that the centers are not on the proper arrangement. So let's see, white, yellow, blue, orange, green should be in here and red should be in here. So green and red are interchanged. So we have to change the arrangement. So face any of the centers that are incorrect and do this. Bring this right side up, get it out of the way and bring this right side back. Now do the same for the left side. Align the centers that have the same color. Bring this left side up, get it out of the way and bring this left side back. Now I'll show you a complete sample solve. Okay, so let's start. This strip can be completed by this two in here. Okay, get it out of the way and bring that side back. Now the strip in here is the next to be solved. Okay, I think this one. Okay, what piece can be used to solve this one? Or maybe this one. Okay, we can use this piece, but how can we do that? Just like earlier, just get that strip out of the way and then reorient the center piece. Okay, bring that down. Now we can match the center piece with the strip in here. Okay, just like that. We can insert this. Now for this strip, we can add one from here to have three in the strip. Okay. One more, okay, this one, but we have to reorient it. Okay, get this strip out of the way. Now, put this piece in here, so when you bring it up, it's already in here. Now you can see that you can bring it up, and match it up with the rest of the green center pieces. Now, insert it to the green side, get it out of the way, and bring this side back. Okay, in this case, we'll solve for the corners first. The corners should be at the place where they are nearest to each other. So we can do the process, bring this right side up, turn the top side clockwise, and then bring this right side down. And then we can exchange the strip with the strip, bring it up, get it out of the way, and bring this right side down. Now we're last with this edge piece, center edge, I mean. So we can do the process that I thought earlier. Bring this right side down. Turn the front side counterclockwise. Now complete this strip in here by bringing down a complete strip from the top. When you see a letter T, turn the front side clockwise. Now when you see a complete strip at the right, bring that up. And you'll see another strip will be completed. Turn the front side counterclockwise and bring this strip back at the top. I just showed you some steps that you can do to solve some situations that you might encounter. That's it. We're done. If you manage to solve it, leave a like in this tutorial. Tell your thoughts in the comments and don't forget to click the subscribe button. Thank you for watching.